Oh, Maurice and Christine, lots of confidence now. At least two key holdouts are apparently back on board, Senators Bob Corker and Marco Rubio. But will that mean the GOP has all the votes? Right now, that's the key question. I think that we are going to be in a position to pass something as early as next week, which will be monumental. And now the GOP has taken giant steps closer. Senator Bob Corker, who's already voted no on the bill in the original version, has changed to a yes. And Senators Marco Rubio and Mike Lee are getting the compromises they wanted as party leaders agreed to increase the refundable child tax credit as part of the tax reform bill. It's amazing what they can do when they want to do it. Rubio and Lee demanded the credit be increased from its proposed $1,000 credit. The revised version makes the credit $1,400. The compromise makes the path to passage much easier. I want to support tax reform. It's important for the country, but I think this needs to be part of it. Two other GOP senators have been battling illnesses. Arizona Senator John McCain and Mississippi's Thad Cochran have missed votes this week. But Cochran's office says the senator will be available for votes as needed. I think John McCain will be here. What about Senator Cochran? I think he will be here also. I'm told he will be here next week. As the president approached what could be his first major legislative victory on taxes, Mr. Trump addressed a graduating class of law enforcement officers at the FBI National Academy and spoke on another one of his top goals, tightening immigration policy. Terrorists have struck in the streets and subways of New York City twice in a few months. One came through chain migration, chain migration, the other visa lottery. They have a lottery. You pick people. Do you think the country's given us their best people? No. What kind of a system is that? The president also took a phone call from Senator Corker this afternoon. The two have exchanged some really very nasty tweets about each other, but now they've come together on the tax bill, which the White House feels it's on its way to passage. Christina Maurice, at least that's what the GOP is saying. We're still waiting on Senators Collins and Flake, but uh, they could be getting much closer now. Sounds that way. All right. Thank you. Dick. Thank you, Dick. <clears throat>